A ferrofluid is a special liquid that contains nanometer-sized magnetic particles. It can adjust its shape in response to a magnetic field. By carefully assembling permanent magnets into a quadrupole, the ferrofluid can surround a second, non-magnetic liquid leading to a so-called liquid tube. The liquid tube has no solid walls and is self-healing, uncloggable, and offers nearly frictionless flow. We can demonstrate this with an experiment. Here, we have two cups filled with viscous glycerol, 1.49 Pa.S-1. On the left, we have a normal solid tube, diameter 1.6 millimeter, length 10 millimeter. And on the right, we have the liquid tube with the same diameter. Upon injection of the ferrofluid, we immediately form the liquid tube. As you can see, the glycerol flows through the liquid tube much faster than the solid tube due to the reduced friction. By adding additional green magnets, we can pinch the liquid tube. By moving the pinching point, we create a pump. Similarly, using an arc-shaped liquid tube, we can make a kind of peristaltic pump, but one without solid wall contact, which we call Q-pump. The end result is a very soft pumping action, which is very useful to transport fragile liquids, such as blood. In traditional pumps, red blood cells experience high shear forces that result in hemolysis by cell rupture which has been associated with clinical complications such as thrombosis and increased morbidity and mortality. Here, human blood is pumped for one hour in a closed loop. In the peristaltic pump, the blood plasma turns red due to cell rupture, whereas in the Q-pump, it remains transparent and the cells come out unharmed. Further quantification shows that the hemolysis is up to 15 times lower normally. Our approach can be extended to pumping other delicate biological liquids.